hello welcome to the Empress farm today we're going to be talking about finance and how to get your finance if you're starting up a business whatever business that may be if it is fish farm whatever side of the agricultural line you want to be in you are in the right place this is where you still you get your options on how to go about your financing finance as we know is important in all that we do is important in whatever line we want to go with is important in it's important for starting up for all the expenses we are going to be going through a whole lot of expenses feed uh, lands whatever that may be you're going to be going through all responsibilities and all the expenses you need to go through so it's going to be important how you source for funds there are no excuses nobody's going to listen to you at the end of the day when you say you couldn't get any help i think excuses are lame it's for people who don't want to make it it's for people who are not serious so there are no excuses just get that in your mind and know that come rain come sun you're gonna get your finance for all you need to start up no matter how small as long as you start so first things first let's jump into it let's know what we're gonna get first we're gonna talk about friends and family that is the basic and the first step everybody starts from you have friends you have family so it's basic it's entitled to everybody if you feel you don't have uh, you don't have any friends you, there's nobody who doesn't have friends if you don't have friends you should check yourself that means you're making wrong company you have friends you have family so those are the people that will be your first cheerleaders they are the people who are supposed to help you start up no matter what you're going to get, you may not be able to get a whole lot of sum from them. There are some families who you will get a whole lot of money to start, but you're not going to get a whole lot of money. But whatever you get is a starting point. It's a point where you start with, you use that as a base for you to move on with yourself. So first things first, friends and family are nice. You're supposed to project yourself. You show them what you can do. You show them your plans. You tell them about your plans. And most of the time to get best uh, ideas from them to get best help from them you should start first for example if you have a land that you want to use that's already available you are lucky go clear it start making plans start preparing it let them see you are trying you are making an effort then believe me it works for everybody they will come in and they will step in for you so first things first friends and family are the first things you should go to second now you should get a job get something that you can do there's always something to be done you could always get a job get something you know i i, I for one when i was starting up new you know there was really no funds what i did was i even before i was able to get access to the land because i knew the land i was going to use i had i knew where the land was situated i knew the owner but i couldn't get in touch with him to get his permission to discuss a type of a payment plan so what did i do instead of waiting and blaming a whole lot of people or blaming myself or what did i do i picked up myself i went to get a hotel job you know, at the time I was I was a graduate. I was I was not young at age, but I was doing some mini. I was doing some jobs. You know, just like they say, they say there there are no mini jobs. There are just mini minds. You understand? So get a job, get something that you could do. End salary. You know, end salary. Then save properly. You know, I was saving like 80, 90 percent of my salary. Even the tips I was getting the hotel. Luckily for me, I was saving everything because I knew where I was going to. I knew what I was going to achieve. And in the space of three to six months, I was able to raise substantial amounts that I, that I used to do my startup. You know, getting to the preparation of the land, securing the land and paying the particular rent. I was able to meet up just from the salary from the hotel job. So it was a sacrifice. I had to sacrifice, I had to sacrifice like 80, 90 percent of my salary, you know, just to make up. And some people will look at you and laugh and like you are working, you are not enjoying yourself. You know where you are going to. So get a job, get a job and just try. You know, there are different things you could do. You could get a side hustle. Or just get, there are some countries you could get multiple jobs. You work early. There are some that you have to work a whole lot of long time. You just have to get something. Then save from there. With your family and friends that was listed before and getting a job, believe me, you will achieve. You will get to the financial goal you are, you are, you are, you are aspiring to so you could do a proper startup for your farm. So don't forget, get a job, get a hustle, something you could raise money with, you know? So that is the number the three step get a loan you know loans are good but there's a way you get your loans don't just go out there and get any loan some some will cripple you some will take you under some you can never re re recover from but at the end of the day this is why this platform is there to help you you know the platform is there for you to know how much you will need 
how much you could make and how much you could have to be able to return part of your loan and if you will meet up so it's always calculation so first things first get draw up a business plan you know it's much easier you drop a business plan then you could secure loans there are government loans that are very friendly there are some private loans that are not bad also you could get a loan three percent five percent eight percent seven percent there are some there are some loans that are not just loans they are grand get to check descriptions don't forget to leave a like button don't forget to subscribe don't forget to share most especially so everybody could get this lovely information at least so people don't go out there and start making mistakes so draw up a business plan get a government loan or get um, a private loan you know and the loans you're going to get remember this is an agric business we're talking about here you're going to require at least four five or six months maximum you know so you're going to get a loan that start counting from six months time like you get a loan then your first payment comes in six months time don't get a loan you're going to pay the next morning you're not going to meet up because your fishes or your your, your birds need time to grow for you to harvest and sell so you get something to pay back your loan so get a loan that start counting ahead from like six months time you get a grace period there are loans that give you grace period there are loans that give you a grace period as much as one year there are someone gives you a grace period as much as five months so make sure you get such type of loan get a loan and that will go a long way of helping you but the loan the, the payment plan the, the percent for the loan should be very low you gonna get a loan that is two digit loan loans from 10 percent 11 percent some some as much as 20 percent it's going to be difficult and before i forget don't get a loan from a commercial banks believe me they are most of them are not friendly their loans as much as 25 percent 24 percent they are not really friendly you could get a loan from from agricultural bank banks of industry banks like that they are different uh platform they're different uh, organizations that give loan you know so just go online make some soft i will leave some of the informations down there be, uh, in the comment section so you could check them out then as for my viewers if you have um, different loans idea if you have different organizations that give loans you could always comment you never can tell who's going to listen who's going to learn i myself i can learn and know what to do next also we are all learning we're all students of this business we're all students of investment platform so get a loan from all this and finally and you'll be fine finally which is not the list of by any uh, means get a business you know you could always do a business inside of a business if you know what i mean you could always do a business a side business there are business who have a very fast turnover you could do fast buying and selling one i could give to you for free right now you could since you're going to uh for example maybe you're, you're going to beds or fish what do you do go to the market get grown uh grow out fishes fish that are big already you know like one kg two kg fishes 2.5 1.5 1.2 1 kg fishes get them you can get like 50 pieces then you bring to to your house or to any space you have put them inside uh a, a good rubber with water then you could always sell on a daily basis you know you could get a fish maybe on average of uh maybe 800 naira uh for nigeria currency you know the equivalent to be in dollars and euro and the rest of them you know you could get then you sell for maybe a thousand naira a thousand two hundred naira depends on your area some you can sell for a thousand five a thousand three to so smaller uh people doing smaller hotels smaller guest house smaller eateries and smaller uh drinking spots you know you can make as much as 300 400 on top of every fish you sell you know you could do that and you could continue to do that even after you start your farm so you could do that then you could try and save up from there with other multiple sources we have already listed from the beginning of this video then before you know you have some such an amount to build up your farm so you get business you could even go as much as buy clothes then you sell normal buying and selling then you raise money from there to do something else you could go as much as driving you know there are ubers now there are different types of um platforms that you could drive sometimes you could even rent a car there are, there are places you rent cars to drive then you pay then you make your money you save up you know it's all works it's all the, the idea is all about working raising money be consistent save then be disciplined be disciplined that's the truth be disciplined save and remain calm Keep god by your side and favor working for you believe me you're going to achieve 
people have done it i myself have done it i'm a living witness i have friends i have colleagues i have partners who have done this and it has worked for them your case will not be different so just remain consistent follow these steps that have been listed then you will achieve your success brothers and sisters we have come to the end of this episode don't forget to like so we can generate more ag uh, algorithm for this video forget to share don't forget to share the video subscribe you know and leave a comment down below so we could know what we are doing well and what can be improved don't forget this is the emperor's farm a place you learn everything about fish farming birds and other types of agri businesses that are out there to make it and to break even in life you know to meet up and to do great things there are there's money in business and i believe everybody should go into a business one way or the other life is all about buying and selling make sure you have a value that you could always give have a nice day yo and see you in the next video have a nice day